Okay, guys, back here with episode. I don't know what the fuck it is. I'm tired. It's kind of late at night. I'm just chilling out to do some corn while I'm uh, playing. And I realized something very quickly. My schedule is fucked up. Badly. And our danger level is increasing quite quickly. I'm going to pause the game because it is going up fucking fast. Um, essentially, we've got 10 prisoners that have serious complaints. One of the prisoners are happy the way they're treated. Five of them are suppressed, and one prisoner has been unnecessarily searched. So, my new plan for the schedule. <laughs> We're going to... They can eat then, they can lock up, 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 lock up. There we go. I'm going to just stop and remake their entire schedule. So they're going to shower then. They're going to... So let's see, yard and yard. The rest of the time, oh, they gotta have dinner at some point. They can eat dinner right then. No. You need just like a. Yeah. Now, our maximum security prisoners, because obviously they're max security for a reason, they're gonna sleep for most of the time, eat, shower, yard, and lock up. That's all they're gonna do all day. Our normal security prisoners were complaining mostly about not having enough free recreational time and shit. For normal and uh, minimum security, actually. So, eat, shower, free time. Uh, I don't know. We can change that to work and input. And that's mixing yard with max security, though. So, we can put. Uh, damn it, I don't know. We can give them an extra hour of yard, I guess. They can. Well, you know what? You know, you know what? We're just gonna go ahead and switch those around, just so it makes more sense. And put it like that. They go yard. They can have a little bit of free time after after yard's done. And then they go to work for an hour. And they can eat their dinner, have another hour of free time, and then go back to sleep. Let's see how they like this new schedule. I hope the danger level starts going down soon. And give it a few minutes and see what happens. Come on, guys. You don't gotta bitch about everything. Oh god, it's going up even higher. It's brought four exclamation marks. Shit. But three prisoners are saying they're well treated. Eight have complaints, down from ten. Um, only three are suppressed, and three have been unnecessarily searched, though. So that is a bit of a problem. Can I use deployment yet? Because I got a feeling I'm going to need deployment very soon. And I still got three hours on it. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Shit, diddle, the diddle. Um, fuck. Although, we got our workshop going here. Which, I don't know when they're going to start working, but... Oh, we need a uh, little room over here for exports. So we're going to go ahead and get rooms. Uh, exports. I'm just going to put it just like that. And we, any products we make can be exported over to there. When they're going to start. What are these guys doing? Oh, shit. What are these guys doing? They're in a reform program. What the hell are they doing? Are you serious? Are you shitting me? Lock that open just for their sanity. And where'd all the wood go? Are they like working now? Well, somebody's working. Ah, minimum and normal security are working. What the fuck? This right here is what is this? This is log. That's all it is. There's a bunch of fucking logs. So, how does. Yeah, I have no idea how the whole work programming works. Um, programs, it's active. The introduction part is, so they're still being introduced to workshop safety right now. So nothing will be produced for a while, I'm guessing. We're going to lock that one open. We're going to lock that one open, I think, for now. And our danger is decreasing, finally. Thank God. I don't want to... 
I don't want to lock the cell block doors open though. I don't like that idea. That seems kind of dangerous. So yeah, we're not going to do that. But some doors we can change. Like we don't need a jail door for the chapel. I mean, come on. We can put. Let's dismantle that door. We'll put one block of concrete, and then we'll put a normal wooden door there, and that should be enough. I mean, it's a chapel. Uh, the shower, I'm going to leave a jail door there, because if we go into lockdown, we can lock him down in there, I'll be fine. Um, we had a fight or something. Who knows what the fuck happened here, because I sure as hell don't know what happened. Doctor, doctor, give him the news. He's got a bad case of being wounded. Okay, what's going on? We got people going to the yard. We got people going to lock up right now. Okay. Oh, it's even color code. Look at that. Uh, max security is going to lock up right now. Normal security is going to yard right now. It's pretty cool. Okay, now I'm sure these guys want something to do. What can I give them to do during yard? Just the weight bench and the phone. That's it. Really? I gotta go to give him something else to do. I mean, something. We can give him old Sparky. <laughs> uh, give him a morgue slab. Let's see. Well, shit. We could give him a pool table and TV. That's for free time, not for yard time. Okay, I'm going to change the schedule up a little bit. We're going to give more free time instead of yard. I'm going to do that right there. And I want to give him a commons room somewhere. I don't know where I'm going to put it. There we go, right there. Look at this. Watch this, guys. Watch this. Okay, we're going to boop, just like that. We're going to put a normal door right there. It's like boop. Gonna put that right there. I'm gonna go ahead and wall that off just like that. Beautiful. Yes. This right here will be our commons room, which we're gonna where prisoners can go for their free time. They'll have bookshelves, they'll have um, TVs, a pool table, maybe. Yeah, so they'll be treated well there. They should enjoy themselves a little bit. Because obviously they look kind of bored in yard. I wonder if the dev plans add like a basketball court or something, considering most prisons have like basketball hoops for their yard. Just saying. Maybe it's just like stereotypical prisons, but still, you get the idea. So, max security prisoners are eating right now, which I guess you only have two of them, which is fine by me. <laughs> um, we can get 20, or we can get. Two more prisoners. So we're gonna go ahead and go ahead and go ahead and go ahead and I repeated myself like four times just now. Go ahead and 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 get two more. I did it again, damn it. We're gonna get two more prisoners to fill our capacity up. <laughs> Simple as that. No, we can get more money, but um, awesome. So our prison is coming together nicely, slowly but nicely. You know, hook that wire up right there rest of the wires are hooked up so now I just need to put beds and toilets and all that good shit go ahead and place all that real quick burning through our money though adding these cell blocks I'll tell you what and also the wall is not done the water is not put in all the way yet a little bit more work to be done still but I'm sure it'll get there in time I'm not worried about it honestly so toilet, 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 and toilet. Boom, bap. Boom, bap. Boom, bap. Boom, bap. Okay. Everything is in place. I just need to finish building it now. I need to designate it as cells. And once it gets designated to be cells, our total capacity should go up to about 40... Four, actually, I think. So, yeah, that's exciting. I mean, hell. But our danger is increasing again. But five prisoners are well treated. So, look at that. I guess they enjoy the new schedule. <laughs> so, that's, that's pretty good so far. Um, 
This place has an entrance. Okay, tear down the fucking door then. We're just gonna dismantle the door, we'll replace it, and see if they will then actually build it. Come on, guys. And all of our normal security prisoners are eating, and as you can see, this is what I meant. How it kind of fills up, kind of gets busy and hectic in there. One of my main concerns is the staff door right there. Because you got one door stopping, two door stopping, and three door stopping escapes. And the thing is, it's only staff doors though. So if they can get a hold of some keys and get through the first one, they can get through them all. Why is the danger increasing now? What are their complaints? Is what I want to know. What are their needs? They want more recreation. Okay, what else? Clothing. How the fuck do you satisfy that? Literacy, we can change that with books. We can change that very soon. Once they take that door out and then put a new door in, we can get that no problem. So, yeah, look at that though. 94% of prisoners have been fed so far on this schedule rotation, which I do like. I like the way I've set this up very much so. Um... So we're going through building all our shit through here, which is excellent. Um, I feel like there's something I was supposed to do that was kind of important, and I've now forgotten. <laughs> and I don't know what it was. But look at our storage area. Look how, I don't know, it looks like it's neat and organized to me. It's not organized and neat, but it looks realistic, I think. Anyway, um, come on, take the door out, guys. Oh, I can place a new one. I guess they're gonna focus on what I told them to build first, which is all the uh, all of the cell stuff here. Because after all, the cells are kind of important. I mean, they're important because of the fact we need to have more prisoner capacity. Because more prisoner capacity means more money. More money means we can have better security. We can expand the prison more. We can offer better amenities to the prisoners and make them happier. Look at that. Our new schedule. Our danger is almost non-existent. Our prisoners are happy with the schedule I created. I'm glad to hear that. That is, that's nice to know. That they appreciate what I did. <laughs> Look at that. Two prisoners have serious complaints. Only two prisoners are complaining. And only one's been searched unnecessarily. So, I mean, I'm not complaining about that. And I just realized they can't get to that door because there's no door here. Like you're supposed to be. I'm a dumbass. We need to place a door right there. <laughs> Go ahead and speed time up so they can get that in there. It should take just a minute. I mean, it should take too long. I guess my pain door stopped playing music for some reason. I don't know why. Anyway. So, the gar why is the gardener, like, sweeping the floor? The fuck? Okay, whatever. Connect. Ooh, what the fuck is this? What the hell did I do? So they can, like, talk across the prison or something? What the fuck? That's pretty cool. <laughs> That's really cool and kind of weird, but anyway. Alright, guys, so I'm also getting kind of tired, and I'm sure this video is running on kind of long, and I know when I get tired, I'll probably either get more talkative or I get more boring, depending on the night. And I feel like tonight's one of the less talkative nights. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and kill the video off here. And, um, again, hope you guys are enjoying. Hope you all stick around and see what's coming up next. i got big plans for this prison. I mean, look, we went from nothing, and we've got two rows of cell blocks. We have two cell blocks, anyway. We've got a cafeteria. We've got a chapel put in. we put in a commons room. I mean, we've got a workshop going. We've got a forestry going. It's, we're getting there. Anyway, I'll see you all next time.